As a new agent, you're typically going to be picking up buyers to work with in your first year as a real estate agent. Once you have established you have a buyer that is interested in a particular product, you need to start sending them listings that fit the criteria of that buyer. Let me show you through the MLS system. Here, I'm using the software Stratus. There is also Matrix, which is not what I'm showing you here. Matrix and Stratus are two different softwares for the same data. Toronto Real Estate Board uses both, gives the agent both options. This little tutorial walks through the Stratus process to identify a prospect and the type of homes they would be interested in so that they receive emails. As soon as the home comes onto the market, they receive that email immediately. Let me show you that process. First thing we're gonna do is we're gonna log into the Toronto Real Estate Board portal, which we are using the Stratus software. This is my home page. First option I'm going to is search properties. Next step, I'm going to use the search option. Here I have various options, of course, to search for property through either map search, through save searches. What I'm looking for is a prospect search. I click on the prospect searches tab. I hit create. I will identify the prospect and their details. If I choose to add a spouse, I can do so in this box here. I can click on the send a copy to myself as the agent and I can also include a map. The product that I'm sending this client here is a freehold, not a condominium, not commercial, but of course, if your prospects matches either of those, click off the box in the option. We are looking for a sale, not a lease or a sublease, and we are looking for a new search as far as the process, or I can search by map in a geographic area. Email subject is of course, freehold properties in Brampton. So of course, Email subject, freehold properties in Brampton. Hello, Trevor. Please review the attached home or homes that might fit your criteria. Let me know if this is something you'd like to go see. And then my contact details, of course. I can use an email signature, which is default, or choose a different style um, that I would like. I hit continue. And this is where I'm actually putting in the criteria, location, and the types of homes. I'm looking for homes in Brampton, which is in the region of Peel. And I might be looking at a specific community, let's say Brampton East, which is typically Peel Village. I'm looking for this client with the property characteristics. This person wants a detached home. The type of home doesn't matter to this particular client, but they do want to have at least three bedrooms in this house. They do want to have three washrooms in the home. And I can, I can drill down as specific as I would like to, but for now I'm just going to use these criteria, detached home, minimum three bedrooms, minimum three washrooms. And you can see that my count say, states that there are eight in the area. I will hit submit. And these are the homes that come up in the area that fit the client's criteria. I'm going to save the prospect, okay? And if I ever wanna manage this or change it, I just click on the manage prospect and I can go through the proce process if I wanna add uh, another person or change up the email. Every morning when a new listing comes on the market, say it came on the market at four o'clock the day before, that email will go out to the individual uh, client approximately 2 a.m. Uh, every, every morning after. So if it goes on at four o'clock at 2 a.m. the next morning, an email will be generated and sent to that uh, prospect. Back into the prospect searches now, you can see that I've, I've identified uh, Trevor Evans. He will be receiving these emails um, from April 4th to July 3rd. If I want to extend this uh, a period of time, I could do so. If I want to delete, of course, I can manage through that. I hope this tutorial gives you a sense of how to set up a new prospect. The key to having a successful real estate business is ensuring that you are the person giving the information to your prospects and you are on top of that relationship and, and providing them that information so they can make a decision. Thank you.